Hello everybody, my name is Miguel, welcome back to a Pokemon Fire Red. Alright, we're still in the rock tunnel, and we got this trainer here waiting to look at my ass cheeks to battle me. I think I'm going the right direction. Do you know how you can avoid getting lost in the mountains? You can bend twigs as trail markers. What? Picking a girl, Sophie. Ooh, Sophia! Right, she sends out a Jigglypuff. You gotta be careful. Jigglypuff's a son. Oh, shit. I don't know if I should use the potion on Pikachu right now. Eh, yeah, fuck it. Oh, yeah, I gotta revive. So, no, that revive is supposed to be for Zedros. Well, ah, oh, goddamn. Oh, get static, paralyzed, bitch. Oh, hold on. Uh, paralyzed. No, I'm not paralyzed. Jigglypuff is- I was, I was gonna give Jigglypuff a Paralyze Heal, no, what the hell? Shockwave! I don't know, my mind just gave me the, the idea that I was paralyzed, but it was Jigglypuff who was paralyzed. Oh god. I gotta take Jigglypuff down before that rollout gets stronger. Does it get stronger with it? Wow. It gets stronger with their return, so that one might take- this one might take me out. Ugh. Okay, I gotta do a quick attack. There we go. So Pikachu's now down to the red. But he's leveled up. Uh, Pidgey. Oh. I don't need to switch out. Unless Pidgey... Unless she's got the Pidgey to do a quick attack. What did I say? What did I say? If Pidgey uses quick attack, it would attack first. And I use Shockwave because Pidgey's weak against Electro types. Oh, uh, I could use Brownie, but Brownie doesn't know any rock moves. Rock tube, there we go. Oh yeah, I taught it that, because I got that from Brock. Oh, there we go. Super effective! Your speed fell! Oh, great. Oh, bird versus bird, eh? Well, first, let me get hurt by this poison, and then I'm going to peck y'all bitch ass. There you go. The battle should be over, unless she has another Pokemon. Yeah, but we're right. I'm going to switch out, because I don't I don't want to risk Zetros getting... Uh, I don't want to risk Zetros. Well, Zetros is going to faint anyway, but I didn't want to risk it in the battle. Uh, so, uh, oh. This would be helpful. So I've started getting some HP. Oh sh Oh. Well, that didn't do much. So that Ivy Circle can get some health. I'm actually gonna use tackle. So that way so that way it can get some so that way Ivy Circle can regain some health. Before I take down the bastard. Ah eh, fuck it, I'll destroy it. I don't want this battle to brag on for too long. Actually, damn it, I always I forget. Hold on, quick, quick second. I needed to put my. There we go. I needed to put my timer. I always forget to put my timer on the thing. Games where I'm playing on a small window, I'm able to put my recording timer there. And other th and then other games, I have to use my phone for the timer. So. Yeah, but this is much more convenient because I can just look over and be like. 420, I just hit 420. Please it! Anywho, back to the subject at hand, which is this Pokemon game. Oh, I did my best. Hey, 420 Poke Dollars! I counted 420 on my timer, and I got 420 dollars. So it's... There we go. Oh. Was that the escape? No, not the escape. Was that the exit? I don't know if I'm at the exit. Let me double check to make sure. Maybe I went too fast and I didn't see that there was another, uh... No, that was my last... That was my last, uh, antidote. Oh, dead end there. I'm pretty sure by the exit is another picnic or girl. So that's how I would know for sure. And one more step and Zetros is faint. There we go, Zetros fainted. But that's fine because I have this... I'd rather use it on Sandtrust than Pikachu. No offense to Pikachu, Pikachu is cool. 
Uh, I think this is the exit right here. Well, this, this goes to the exit. Ha ha, can you beat my power? Maybe. Depends what you got. Maybe Geo dudes. I guess right. The hiker dudes are always. It, it never. It never. It, it never fails. The hiker dudes always have ground or rock types. In this case, rock types. Defense curl. Oh, you predicted that I was gonna say the Ivy saw, huh? Well, too bad. You can get Razor Leaf. That's gonna be super effective, and that's gonna take you out at one hit because level 25, bitch. Now I'm at level 26. Well, no, well, almost. After this one, I'll be level. I'll be so will be level 26, and just 10 more, le 10 more levels to go, and it'll be at a Venus sword. I'm all fucking hardcore as fuck. Okay, now it's gonna be at level 26. There we go. So there we go. Graveler. I could have sent out Brownie, but I mean, I mean, it probably still would have worked against Graveler, like the magnitude and dig. Because rock and just rock Pokemon are weak against a ground type. Oops, out muscled. So that ended that battle. So is it was it up that I got it? Oh. That would have been another battle that I could have fought. Oh, so I think this is the way out. I just need to... Yeah. Those are not the picnickers I was talking about. There's like, right at the exit, there's a sign that says something about like the rock tunnel exit or something. And then there's a picnicker trainer there. I'm actually gonna go ahead and... Uh, come, come, I'd be comparing Ivysaur to the other Pokemon. These guys are a bit behind on the levels. To probably work on that. Doesn't affect Zetros. Nothing affects Zetros. So there we go. There goes Zobat. Bye, Zobat. So, so that, that says that. I was I was waiting for her to just like look at me and challenge me to a battle. Onyx is cool. I've had a Steelix once. You get like a metal coat in like gold and silk. Gold and silver and crystal and I don't, I don't remember who gives it to you but you get it like a metal coat you let onyx hold that and then you're supposed to tr i think you train it be friendly with it or i think it's the same or i think you have to uh trade it kind of like how you have to trade haunter to get gengar and machoke to get machamp and graveler to get golem you have to trade them and then they evolve right after I think the same applies for Scyther and Onyx. I don't remember. To get Steelix, you have to give him the metal coat or iron something. Iron coat or metal coat? He has to hold that, trade it, he evolves to Steelix, and then Scyther, give him a metal coat, trade it, and he evolves into Scyzor. And I've had both those Pokemon before. Yeah, this is DX right here. So this is the last battle, Arahara. I came this far looking for wild Pokemon. Good for you, you want a fucking trophy? I'm doing the same thing too. You ain't the only fucking one. Meowth. Wow. Level 20 against level 20. Eat pursuit, bitch. No. Oh. oh. Fury attack. This is... One more. Oh. You only hit twice. You only want to hit twice, huh? Lazy. You know, lazy. Don't want to hit one more time? Oh, well, you... Hit one time there and that took care of it. Every time. Every every time so far. I say something, I try to say something, and he just shuts me up by doing the job. Like when he used to be a Spiro. He tried to do Peck, he missed. And then next time he did it, he didn't miss, but he got a crit. And I was like, wow. I'm impressed. Zetros has been. This is this Zetros is gonna carry this team to victory. He's gonna, he's gonna he's gonna carry this whole team to victory. Even through the Pokemon League too. Maybe. Unless I decide to switch Zetros off for another bird type. 
to fly, maybe. Uh, I don't know. I'm thinking. I was thinking about getting a Dratini and training it to a Dragonite. Oh, that it's hard. Tra training Dragon type Pokemon are hard. They're no, that's no joke. Oh, I missed. I tried Fury Tech and I missed. Stun Spore. Poopy. I think I can still hit him. I should have used Peck from the start, but my talking. Confused me. Well then. Of course, when I'm paralyzed, it attacks first. There you go. There you go. That's the ticket. So you sweet sit again. And I'm gonna use Peck again. Now, and that should take care of you. Bye bye, Artish. Still with one more. Oh boy. Brownie. <laughs> Come on out, Brownie. Alright, Rock Tomb. Well, uh, PG, take care of the quick attack first and then use Rock Tomb. X. One more hit should do it. One more hit should do it. I'm gonna use Rock Tomb again. Just to ensure that it faints. And, yep, yeah, it's done. It's done. Almost level 23. You could have just given me a little bit more. I'm out of Pokemon. 400 bucks. Alright, so this is the exit. Freedom! Uh, those, these, are other, these are trainers. I want to... Careful with that. There we go. All right, Lavender Town. So you could hear that right away. I'm on fast forward. Hope to see you again. So you can hear it right away. That music. That that music is so uh, creepy. So this version is different than the Japanese ones because those ones, wait, I think it maybe would work on adults as well okay so I'm gonna buy a couple more I'm gonna buy some more super I'm gonna buy up to 10 I can buy great balls now how many well, I need to see that I need to see how much I got of that I'm gonna add to those I'm gonna buy like six of those uh, escape rope I don't know how many of that I got in bag seven I'll buy like three more super repel I still got I still got some repels Great ball. Well, how many Pokeballs do I got? Uh, we'll check the sale. 12 Pokeballs. The better the, 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 like, the, each ball has, like, its own different catch ratio, so Pokeball is, like, like, normal. And Great Ball would be a better chance. Ultra Ball, more of a better chance. And there's the Master Ball, which is outstanding. So maybe I can s sell all of these. Wow, no, I won't even get any at all. I won't. That's like not enough. That's like not even any. Then again, why would I even do that? So no, not sell. Damn it. There we go. Buy. I'll just buy like a couple of these. Like five of those. So five of those. And we're out of here. Alright, so this is the creepy part about Lavender Town. You get to go in this tower, but... Like, before I would normally just explore it right away, but... To even, like, do this part, you need the Sylph Scope. And... I don't have the Sylph Scope because I have to get it over from the Sylph Company. And that's in Saffron City. But I can't access Saf Saffron City at the moment because I need... To get something over at Celadon, which is the next gym. The rain Rainbow... Gym, the Rainbow Badge. The leader is Erica, and her speciality is grass type Pokemon. So we're going over there right now to Celadon. So Lavender Town, I only was just there to heal my Pokemon, but we're gonna be going back over there for a segment of the story, of course. And we're like basically, like what most people say, we'll get back to that soon. For now, I only got there so you guys could hear a little bit of what the music sounded like, and 
so I can heal my Pokemon. And and then right now I'm going to ooh Growlithe. And then right now I'm going to Celadon so I can handle the business there. If I remember correctly, Celadon has the big gigantic Mart Pokemon Mart, and you can actually buy the evolution stones there. And I'm gonna buy a Thunderstone so I can later on evolve Pikachu into Raichu. But before I can think about doing that, I need to beat this ball headed douche bit though. Anyway, the Mart was selling burn heals and I right in my I didn't say it well I said in my mind don't buy that because there's really no reason to buy that and what happens immediately I get burned that reminds me I do need to get a I still do I still do need a water type let's finish it off with a magnitude that should be that should take the, re the rest of its health out there we go That's brownie evolves into the trio at level 30 I think so I need seven more. Whoa, Pix. Ooh, nice. I also need a fire type. I think I just remember that. Water and a fire type. I already got flying. I already got electric. I already got ground. And I already got grass. But I think I might get rid of Brownie to make room for another type, which would be either Ghost or Psychic. Because I need one of those to be able to survive the battle against Sabrina. With them at the Saffron Gym, but that's gonna be later. Once I go back to Lavender Town. So wait, who? I, I don't remember, oh, Vulpix. Who's gonna send out Vulpix? Ah, I could keep Brownie out there. I've been blabbering about what I'm gonna be doing in different cities when I should be focusing on this battle. Like really, Magnitude Ten. Get Ten Dome. Magnitude Ten Dome. Yowch. Thank you. I'll be here all day. It is hot as shite in my room. I don't use my fans. I don't use, well, I have, I'm using my fan, but at the lowest, lowest setting. Because if you use your fans, your microphone, even if it's like the best at reducing background noise, it's going to attract some noise in the background. And it's going to pick up your fans. So I have them off. And I have my window closed because... It's random when you get like a random douchebag passing through in a loud ass motorcycle and I've already had uh, I already had too many of that today. So I don't I don't want none of that. I don't want to deal none with the random motorcycle noises. Cause those guys are assholes. I think over here I can get a Growlithe or a Volpix here in this grass area. I know you can get them at the Pokemon Mansion in Cinnabar, but also over here as well. And a Pidgey as well. Maybe I should catch the Pidgey and name that one Zetros again. Nah. The reason why I caught, I, why I decided to catch Zetros because most of my Pokemon playthroughs, I always catch Pidgey and use it as the Pokemon that will fly me around when I get fly. I'm catching this guy because, you know, I hardly ever use him th that much. And he learns a cool move. I don't remember what level. I think it was level 30 or something. Called Drill Pick. Ooh, one more time. Drill pick, and that's a really nice move right there. That's a move only Firo, aka Zatros, would know. Let's try one more time. I think there has to be one here. Nope, just a Pidgey. I accidentally put my finger on the fast forward button, so. Mm. We'll try it. So, well, there's more grass over at the. by Celadon, so. Oh yeah, I forgot there's these douchebags. More of these guys. Gotta be careful because they're, they're probably gonna want to try to challenge me. Oh yeah, I can't go through there because that, that goes to that goes to Saffron. And there we go. So you gotta take this one. This one goes from Lavender to all the way to uh, Celadon, Celadon City. Oh. I just remembered. A lot. You can get a lot of shit from in Celadon. Okay, hold on. 
Well, let's let's heal up my let's heal up my squad. Okay. In here, you can get this. Well, let, let's take care of this first since we're already here. To be able to, cause there's some tower, there's some areas where there's some guards, and to get to Saffron City, you can't go to Saffron City because they keep saying like, oh, you can't pass. Oh, I'm so thirsty. Oh, oh, oh you can't pass. So. You have to get some. You have to get some hot tea from this lady and use it on the guards, and the guards will let you pass through to Saffron City. In all every, every, every everywhere, from Cerulean to Saffron to Celadon to Saffron, Vermilion to Saffron, and so on. You shouldn't spend your money on drinks. Try this instead. I'm trying to tea. Nothing beats thirst like some hot tea. I prefer cold tea. Thank you. It really is the best. Thank you, lady. All right, so. I'm going to take care of that right now. I always keep forgetting the back button. So I'm going to take this, deliver this tea to the guards. So I can pass through Saffron. Oh, that tea. It looks awfully tasty. Huh? I can have this drink? Gee, thanks. If you want to go to Saffron City, you can go on through. I'll share this tea with the other guards. And... Yay! We're in Saffron City! This is where the, the psychic gym leader Sabrina is at, but I can't fight her yet because she has rocket. There's like rockets guarding the place. I have to beat the self. Well, there, well, here's the thing. There are two gyms in here. This is Sabrina's. This is the legit gym. This is just a karate gym that if I win, I can get either... I can choose between a Hitmonlee or a Hitmonchan. But I won't do that. At least not now. So I'm in Saffron City now. And I don't need to do anything here, just like Lavender Town, I don't need to do anything here yet. My concern for right now is Celadon City. Alright, so that's one of the things I can get. The Mart I'm gonna handle after the battle with Erica. Over here you can, uh... I keep hitting the walls. Over here you can actually buy Pokemon like Abra, Scyther, Dratini. But you can catch a Dratini in the Safari Zone also. By using a, a fishing, a fishing rod. So this is okay. So in this place again, you could also. Oh okay, yeah, I only have like four types, four Pokemon. So it should be up here. I'm hoping. Up here is where you can get Eevee, the Pokemon that can evolve into. Well, in this game, three different types, but it evolves into a lot more. Jolteon, the electric type. Flareon, the fire type. Vaporeon, the water type. Glaceon, the ice type. Leafeon, the grass type. Sylveon, the fairy type. And I'm pretty sure there's more. I just don't know. Maybe like a steel type? Steelion? I, I don't know. The, I don't know the name. So there goes our hair. I got an Eevee. Give the nickname to Eevee. Uh, what should I name it? I don't know what I'm gonna evolve it to though. I, I don't know yet. Crap. Because I already got Pikachu, which is electric type. A water type I need. But I wanna. The water type I need, but. You get a free Lapras when you beat Silph Scope. And Lapras is a really good, strong water type. So I think I'm gonna go, and I need a fire type, so I think I'm gonna go with Flareon. So I'm gonna give them a name. Uh, what would be a good, like, fire ish kind of name? Uh, what would be a good name? I guess I'll go with this. Just to make it, like, cool. With the Z. Flames. Because I'm gonna give it a Firestone. Well, that's a th well, the only downside to evolving an EV is... Well, is... It doesn't... Once it evolves to that certain type... Once it evolves to that certain type, it won't know the moves... Jesus, these stairs and me for being an idiot. It won't know the moves until once it's leveled up some more. 
which sucks. Do I even have any fire? No, I don't. I don't think I do. I have a water move, water pulse. So the Mart I said I was gonna handle. Well, what level is Eevee at? Oh, 25. Wow, that's cool. So that so Eevee can level up. What man? Well, let's see if I can teach it some moves. Do I have any moves good enough for this Eevee? I can teach it Dig. Yeah. Flames wants to move Dig. So let's see. So it only knows Quick Attack, Growl, Sand Attack, and Helping Hand. Uh there's not much. There's not much double battles in this game. There is one which we get fly, but other than that, there's no. There's not that much double battle tag battles, double battles in this game. So I'm gonna get rid of Helping Hand. But I don't see no much use for that. So Machine Head, stick, force the DVD in their forehead. Oh, flames learn dig. And then there's all these other moves. Water Pulse for a water type, but just for the sh shits and giggles. No. You get a gri you can get a Grimer here for some reason. I think. Wait a minute. Hold on. If I remember right again, maybe they're in this part of the city. Oh, I didn't get it. No one, no one wants to nibble on my rod. Nobody wants it to nibble on my rod. Okay, okay. again. Oh yeah, I gotta pay attention to that. I've been recording for a while, so I gotta be careful. I gotta... Oh, Pokemon's on the hook. Okay, okay. After this, damn it! Damn it, Magikarp! How many times you gonna bother me? I can't. I can't just do. I can't just like wipe you out because you you weak. I could have sworn you can get polywags here in this part in this little pond where this guy's at. You can't go reach that guy until you get surf. All right, fuck it. Up here, you could also... Up here is... The Rockets hideout. Yeah, this guy. Oh, yeah. That guy's there. I don't know if I should handle this before the gym... No, I think I should handle the gym battle before... I deal... Take care of the gym battle before I, uh... Battle... Before I battle that guy. Because you have to battle him and then he runs away and then... There's an underground rocket hideout there. I'm not gonna do that until I reach the next video. I had to fast forward that just so I can get through there. So I'm gonna go over to this gym over here. Hey, this gym's great. It's full of women. All right. So I'm gonna cut it here because I've already been going on for way too long. I was supposed to have ended, but I didn't pay, I didn't pay attention. So it's been like 28 minutes over here so far. We'll pick this up in another video. We're gonna battle Erica, and then we're gonna try to see if I can, uh, well, depending on the time, because I try to keep these videos less than 30 minutes at least. If I haven't stopped under 25, then I usually go for it. under 30 minutes, but anywho, thank you guys so much for watching, we'll continue this in the next video. If you guys like this video, give this video a thumbs up, it'll help me a lot, I'll greatly, greatly appreciate it, and until next time, see you guys in the next video. Bye. Bye. Thank you.